Oh! Uh-oh, I hit something. Oh, the whole ship is falling! Hello, YouTube! Komodo Gaming here, bringing you guys another episode of Teardown, and yes, folks, we're back once again, and no, your eyes are not deceiving you, that is a Titanic in Teardown. Uh, the creations and mods are getting even more insane. This is by Fox. This is from the official Teardown Discord. I'll have a link down in the description. So we're going to be destroying this here today, but stay tuned because we also have another map we're going to be checking out. We have a car grinder. So let me know what you think down in the comment section below. Also, while you're down there, hit that thumbs up button for some more Teardown on the channel. And uh, let's take a part of Titanic. All right, so for this, I'm gonna turn off the death beam mod. As much as I wanna use it at the beginning, I'm gonna refrain from using it. I wanna see if we can tear this thing apart. It looks like it's, oh, it's not metal. Oh, <laughs> we can actually hit right through this, can't we? Wait, okay, that's sick. Hold on, let's start hitting the floor out. Now, it's not fully detailed. Obviously, that would probably create a tremendous amount of lag, but it looks like there might be some things on the inside. Oh, it could be completely hollow. Hold on, let's jump up here. No, it looks like it's completely hollow. That would be actually the, the bridge is right there. I kind of wish we could fly and tear down. Oh, uh, we can make our own stairs. Let's just go ahead and get our blowtorch here. Let's cut through this. It's fine. We're just going to cut up the side. I wonder if this thing sinks. Uh oh. Oh no. Wait, is this, is this actually made of wood? You're telling me we can light the whole Titanic on fire? Oh, that is epic looking. Okay, hold on, jump up here. Uh, oh, go down here. Go down through here. Uh, hold on. Let's just travel to the back real quick. Let's just go ahead and start lighting the whole thing up. I want to see if we can sink it this way. This is probably going to be very laggy here in a second. Oh, no. Okay, run, 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 run. Uh, this is kind of awkward. It's a little laggy on the inside. It's something with the lights, I believe. Hold on. Oh, it's getting a little tight. Oh, jeez. Yeah, I'm getting some weird skipping right now. Lighting it on fire probably wasn't a good idea. Hold on. Let's go down here real quick. What does it look like? Is it completely burning in the front? Oh, you can see the fire up on the side. I wonder if we just cut a big hole in the side of it, if we can get it to somewhat sink. Uh, let's uh, work our magic with the blowtorch. We're gonna say we hit an iceberg here, and we're gonna go, yeah, there we go. And then cut it down in the water. All right, cut the bottom out, that's fine. There we go, just let some of that water in. I don't think that's doing anything. You know, we could just throw a person at it, huh? Chunk of guy at the Titanic. Oh, that was a mistake. Oh, actually, that did a lot of damage. Hold on, chunk another person at it. By the way, this is the human mod. We checked this out the other day. I have a link down in the description for my teardown playlist. So if you guys want to check that out, that's actually kind of amazing looking. There we go. Uh oh, oh, we're lagging now. Oh, let's go yeet. And oh, he's bouncing off the side. Oh, the destruction and teardown is amazing. Okay, so that doesn't seem to be doing the trick here. So, I mean, we got a shotgun. Can we shotgun the Titanic? I mean, that kind of looks cool too. Hold on, shoot it here, open it up here. Uh, you can see what's on fire right now. Oh, the whole front end's burnt out. That's cool looking. All right, well, that's not working. Um, I mean, I guess we could just cut it in half with the blowtorch. Like, I feel like that could potentially work. Uh, what is the halfway point? I would assume between the, the funnels here or the stacks. Let's go about right in this area. And we're going to attempt to saw this in half with the blowtorch. Yep, we're just uh, deconstructing the Titanic here. This is completely fine. Okay, let that go up there. I'm going to have to get up on the deck somehow and start up there and try to cut it from the top. Uh, let's go underwater. Oh, this thing is a lot deeper than I thought it was. Wait, can I not dive in the game? I don't think we'd be able to do this. Yeah, I can't get any lower. I think you're gonna have to use the death beam to cut it in half. I mean, that's probably okay. You know what? We're gonna enable it real quick. Let's go ahead and see what the death beam does to this thing. I'm pretty sure this is gonna be devastating. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. Oh no. There it goes. All right, I'm getting some lag. Let's try to cut the Titanic in half. Is this gonna actually work? Dude, that is cool looking. And, oh, wait, what just killed me? Huh? I'm very confused right now. All right, so we're back on the Titanic. It's burnt out quite a bit. I think this fire is going to actually continue until it burns all the wood. Uh, it's creating some uh, very nice lag, but hold on, let's look in here. Where's that cut? Oh, there it is. All right, so we're cutting half right here. Hold on, let's maybe take this portion out. 
Okay. Oh. Yeah, we might want to get rid of this fire. I feel like I should reset the, uh, the ship real quick. All right, one more thing. Let's just look at it real quick. Just admire this. Like, this is a work of art. I can only imagine how long this took the creator. Fox has done a good job here. Like, the detail. Whew. That's nice. Uh, by the way, I just want to chop off a stack real quick. Let's go. There it goes. And, oh, that kind of collapsed to the back. All right, so let's commence cutting this thing in half again. Uh, I want to see if we can get it to sink. So let's go three, two, one, chop. And there it goes. Okay, something killed me earlier. It might have been the beam hitting the water. I don't know if that's a thing. Oh, this is running so much smoother. Look at that clean cut there. I mean, it's not that clean, but it looks nice. Uh, it's clean by Komodo standards. Okay, cut down. Okay, question is, did we just cut through the bottom? Oh, I can see down. Is that a reflection or is that actually on Dunker head? Oh, yeah, we cut through the bottom. Huh. It didn't do anything. It didn't sink. So maybe we should cut like this. Oh, this is going to create some lag here. All right, let's go up the side. You know, everything we do in Teardown is laggy, which, by the way, I am going to continue the campaign. I know uh, we've been playing with a lot of mods recently, but I haven't forgotten about the story. And I want to continue that because there is a group of people that actually really likes the campaign mode uh, on the channel. And, oh, wait, that didn't collapse that? I feel like that should have collapsed that. All right, the death beam is just OP for the Titanic here. Uh, let's cut up the side here. We'll do one more cut. I just want to cut completely through this side. Okay, what is supporting the Titanic here? I feel like this should fall down. Uh, let's just go... Oh, just go through that side. Okay, moving the death beam at high speed is not a good idea. Oh, okay. On. Maybe we can collapse that funnel real quick. Uh, destroy that piece. There goes the funnel. So there's one through there. Okay, we are just completely destroying the Titanic right now. This is great. Oh, uh oh, I hit something. Oh, the whole ship is falling. Oh, that is epic looking. And oh, the, the frame rate. Hold on. It's. Wait, it just settled on something. Hey! Look at that. I think it's actually okay. Oh, there goes the stacks in the water. All right, let's do another cut here. Let's go down from here. And there it goes. Folks, I feel like we've done it. I mean, we've cut it in half. We've pretty much completely destroyed it. Uh, there's a couple more things we could do. Like I can chop maybe down here and see if we can separate it out. I was trying to see if I can get it to like fall off into the water, which I think it's somewhat possible. Oh, there it goes. Speaking of falling off into the water. Oh, you know what? It seems like the base of it's kind of like static. So I think you need to completely destroy the base in order to make the ship collapse into the water. Which we're kind of doing that right now, even though it's like zero frames. Uh, but yeah, that's going to take a lot. And that's going to be very, very laggy. So you know what? We should probably just admire the awesome destruction here and how amazing the ship looks. Yeah, definitely thanks to Fox for that. But let's go on and move to the next thing. All right, so we have ourselves a fun little map here. This is by Tree Burgers. This is a car crusher or car shredder, I should say. You know, this kind of looks like the shredder from Brick Rigs. It kind of has that look to it. So we've got some vehicles spawned in on the map. There's some awesome looking, these are like prototype racers. Uh, hold on. This is amazing. I kind of want to just drive this around. Oh dear. And up, oh, that is a car, and that's a tree. And up, oh, that's the end of the map. Oh, let's just eat this off the map real quick. There it goes. Oh, I'm still riding on it. Oh, there it goes. Bye, Mr. Car. Oh, it froze. Huh. Okay, so that's a thing. So how does the uh, the old car shredder actually work? Do we just drop cars in it? Does it automatically turn on? Uh, hold on, let's check this out. Let's drop this car. By the way, I want to see a big racetrack with these cars. Uh, the car physics and teardown, they're surprisingly pretty awesome. What the? Okay, I high centered. Hold on. <gasps> oh, yeah, I've got the death beam on. All right, let's try this one real quick. So the other car kind of bottoms out. I think I have to hit this with speed. So here we go. Gas it up. Oh, okay, here we go. And we're in the grinder. Uh oh. Oh, wait. All right, there's got to be a button on here. <laughs> I'm looking at this and wondering why this isn't working. Um, Button. All right, here we go. Let's go ahead and start it up. Oh, you know, it just fit it right out. I feel like it's got to be moving when it goes in the top. So here, 
We spared the car for just a second. All right, let's turn it around and we're gonna drive it back up. I don't think it's gonna bottom out anymore. The front end's gone. All right, so we'll go up here and we're gonna do a little drop. There it goes. Oh, that is cool. Maybe it needs to go in the side. I thought that was gonna shred it apart. I feel like I'm using this wrong. Maybe it needs to go in sideways. You know, we could just throw in a, a human. Like that would be cool too. All right, so let's go up here. And we're stuck again. Okay, so maybe it's a van that needs to go in there. By the way, this van feels like it wants to flip. Okay, turn it around. All right, and we're gonna go up. And we're gonna go to the side this time. There we go. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. Oh, that is beautiful. Oh, and oh, it's gonna, oh, it's stuck. Oh, it's stuck in the teeth. Oh, the destruction, this is amazing. Wait a minute. I think it's kind of jammed in the grinder. Did I help it? Wait, what happens if I death beam the grinder? Does it break it? No, I think it's indestructible. Oh, okay, the car's still trying to kind of traveling through. Let's break up the car a little bit for the uh, the grinder. That's awesome. Okay, we're totally gonna stick a person in the grinder now. Uh, prepare yourselves. Here we go. Oops, I kind of missed. No, this is fine. Chunk him into there. Oh, little to the side. Uh oh, we broke off the back of the grinder. This is not okay. Oh, there he goes. Oh, ooh. And all you see is guts. This is fine. Haunt. Let's try chunking him up. Well, he angled back down. Where is he going? Where is he going? Oh, that was his head. Okay, I'm back it up. Okay, chunk that one over to the side. Let's try this one here. And oh, oh, that looked like it hurt. Oh, there goes his head. All right, let's throw him off to the side. Oh, geez, that's us. Oh, and we are in the grinder. Oh, look at the body parts that have fallen through here. <laughs> that's cool. And we walk up. There's uh, chunks falling down. I kind of just want to fill it up. Oh, that was a good one. That one went right in. We also went right in again. I wonder if we could just fill this thing. Like, let's overload this with people. All right, here we go. We're just chunking as much as we can at it. There it goes. Kind of have to do it sideways, the way the, uh, the weapons or the launcher launches the people. Oh, there we go. We're going to break this. We're gonna jam the grinder up. Oh, this is cool looking. There goes another person. And we got another one. <laughs> and we got another, uh oh, the grinder stopped moving. We've officially jammed it. Oh, no, it's powering through, hold on. I wanna jam it. Keep throwing people in there. Oh, oh, oh. Ooh. Okay, so what have we done here? Uh Oh, we've definitely broken the grinder. Oh, the grinder's overloaded. Uh oh, okay, back off. Um, so we officially have filled the grinder and it's laggy. You know, I feel like it's like my ultimate goal to break the game or something. Yep, we've definitely broken it. So the grinder's full, it's shifting and it's moving around. I, I don't really like this, but we, uh, we learned that grinders and teardown work really, uh, really pretty good, except for when you throw like 20 or 30 humans in there, then it doesn't work so well. So. Anyways, go check out the mods. They're linked down in the description. Go check out the teardown playlist. Thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you guys next time.